Well, if the last couple years haven't made you paranoid enough when it comes to your health, a new report on the chemicals seeping into the human body may take the cake. <laughs> this in a report at Study Finds. Researchers from the University of California, San Francisco, have uncovered over 100 different foreign chemicals inside of people. Even more unnerving, 55 of these substances have never been discovered in humans before. Great. Let's see what this is all about. Okay. Tracy J. Woodruff, PhD, a professor of obstetrics, gynecology, and reproductive sciences at UCSF. <laughs> she might have an idea of how some of these things got in there. <laughs> Sorry. She said, quote, These chemicals have probably been in people for quite some time, but our technology is now helping us to identify more of them. Oh, well, that's different then. Never mind. <laughs> I'm kidding. I'm not sure if what you don't know won't hurt you works in this case. Researchers say many of these chemicals come from common consumer products and industrial materials. However, the team calls 42 of these substances mystery chemicals, whose sources are unknown at this time. Mystery chemicals? Come on, this isn't potluck at high school lunch, people. Well, come to think of it, maybe this is where a lot of those came from. Study authors made the discovery through an examination of pregnant women and their babies. Ah, now I see why the lady doctor was involved. What? That's not politically correct? No, I mean, not that she's a woman, but I mean that she's like a lady parts doctor. Oh, we don't just say gynecologist? Okay. <laughs> I guess that's why we don't call sky waitresses stewardesses anymore, too. I kid. Okay, getting back to the serious part here. The scary part is that these chemicals are not only in the blood of the expecting mothers, but also in their newborns. This suggests that many chemicals can travel through the mother's placenta before birth. So here's what they're finding. 40 are an ingredient in plasticizers, 28 are found in cosmetics, and 25 come from consumer products. Another 29 chemicals are ingredients in pharmaceuticals, and 23 reside in common pesticides. The analysis also discovered three chemicals which are common in flame retardants. Other compounds discovered by the study are used in making carpeting, upholstery, and other appliances. Holy crap! Now, they haven't said much about how much of this stuff they're finding, but I'm really starting to feel like the lint screen in my dryer. Okay, scientists are concerned that it is unknown how a lot of these things are getting into people. And speaking of dryers, where the hell are my socks, by the way? How come we don't know where those go either? Researchers hope that the EPA and companies will do a better job at managing the cloud of unholy crap we are being exposed to every time we take a deep breath. In the meantime, I'm going to be careful about where I breathe and how deep I breathe, I guess. We have a lot more info on this and other surveys and studies. Just click the link in the description below and head over to studyfinds.com.